we have a couple more things to do here before we go on to the next set of, set of steps. The first one is, um, as you, if you might notice from the last take, I've moved the, moved the rocks around a little bit, turned it into a little bit of a U. I'm going to be using live plants in the aquarium, uh, my choice. And to do that, generally to make a nice living picture, I will use a tall plant here and a tall plant here. It needs to be rooted, so we have to make sure that there's enough of a platform there so that the roots can, the roots can be held down. I probably will have some digging fish in the, in the, in the future, so I don't want to have uh, a very thin amount of gravel. Uh, here's that other rock that we did. Um, I think that I'm going to put it here, stick it out. It separates the, it separates it, and will tend to tend to keep the gravel in its in its area back here. I'm going to have another tall plant back there, and I'm going to have a few plants in here, and probably some plants in there. This is just to give them a little bit of hiding spaces, places to places where they can um, rest and and basically fight and create the territory. The king of the tank will probably own that area. Uh, the plants will be here for protection for the rest of the rest of the aquarium uh, inhabitants and we have basically something that's a beginning on the bottom a lot of them will be up in the water swimming swimming in this area but when they want to rest and and things like that they do have places to hide the last thing i'm going to do is i'm going to put on a background now i've cut it already to side to the size of the back basically it comes as a, a plastic sheet uh, it can be either um, printed like this, or it can be um, black. And now I'm going to use the black side. It's just basic, basic personal preference. How you, do, how you decorate the tank is always, always your, your particular uh, taste and what you're, what you're planning to do with the aquarium. I'm going to be doing a fair bit of um, photography and stuff like that, and I don't really want a busy background that's going to Take uh, take up a lot of a lot of the a lot of the the good looking of the fish. As you can see, it goes black quite fast. I'll use four pieces of uh, tape um, on the corners. That holds them holds the background there. It won't fall down once the filters are in the are in place and all that kind of stuff. There'll be very little problem. You can let it go to the bottom. Remember, the only parts that are really important are from about this level down here below. So now we have a black background. We have the, we have the decorations in the tank. We're ready to start adding water.